president of Beloit College hosted a discussion today after white pride posters were put up around campus earlier this week. The event was open to all students, staff, and faculty. Rock County reporter Jenna Middaw talked with students on campus today and has more on what they had to say. Students I spoke with say the conversation with the president today was a good first step, but there's much more work to be done. If the students are not holding each other accountable for the stuff that goes on, nothing's going to change. Beloit College students were shocked earlier this week when they found white supremacist posters put up around campus. I'd had friends posting on Facebook about it, friends who took down posters themselves. Campus leaders called the acts appalling. We're trying to investigate who actually put up the posters. President Scott Bierman addressed the campus community today and invited students and staff to come talk about the issue. Jason Dorman went to the event. I needed to hear for myself what he had to say and where he stood and what the college was doing about these issues. And while he's glad the college is looking into who put up the posters. It's just a bit more encouraging to know that they're actually doing something. He and other students say there's still a long road to recovery. Senior Tessa Sebastian wants students to be more open to talking about these kinds of issues outside of formal meetings. We can have meetings like this on campus where, you know, tons of people meet and get together and talk about this issue, but how do we know if anyone who is responsible for posting the posters even sh came and heard what was said? There's no way to know. In order to make a difference, she says students have to keep the conversation going with each other. You have to be prepared to listen, but you also have to be prepared to talk and um, be honest with each other, you know. Be frank about why certain things are not okay for a community and why uh, we need to listen to each other. The president says the conversation doesn't end with this meeting. He's hoping the talks continue throughout campus. In Beloit, Jenna Middaw, WISC News 3. A Beloit Together event will be hosted at the college this weekend. Now, the goal is to stand united as a community against acts of hatred and violence. It starts Sunday at 4 in Horace White Park.